youth runner here with uh, Santana sophomore star Harper Diaz and uh, that star uh, got a lot brighter uh, today at the 44th A6 Mount Carmel Invitational. She's the Invitational uh, girls winner 17.54.3 uh, first performance under 18 uh, on the day and I have a feeling uh, it's going to be a tough standard for anybody else uh, to chase. Uh, Harper uh, obviously just your growth, not only literally in, in, in height, but just, yeah. uh, but just in terms of just your confidence and, uh, and your belief. It's just been such a special thing uh, uh, to watch, you know, through you know, cross country last year, obviously track, and, and then now uh, the early part of, uh, of, of the season. Like, just how, how affirming, how validating is it to have performances like, uh, like this on such a big stage on obviously the course that matters most to you in San Diego? Um, I think this season has been like really big. We've had like three meets this season, but I've had a big jump from last year. So it's been really like exciting. I've had a good summer of training and everything. So it's been really good to see these good results come out of it. Most definitely. How would you uh, assess just in terms of how much you've you've learned, like how much you feel like you've you've you know developed and uh, and evolved as an athlete versus you know, the, uh, the woman that was coming in as a freshman last year, you know, uh, versus you know, having a full year and then you know, uh, and then you know kind of applying it now this year. Um. I think it has been like a big jump last year. I was just like coming in not really knowing what to expect or anything. And now like this year it's been like it's been like really good to coming in and like people like I knowing these people like being able to race against them since from last year. Most definitely. To be able to I mean obviously I know you know how much respect that Eliza and Emily have for you and uh, and obviously uh, you in kind uh, and so obviously you always have to be you know aware of you know you know, where, you know where they might be, especially when you know you're coming you know, back up as other people are, you know, are, yeah. are, are going down in that in that transition there. Uh, but just how encouraged were you? Like you just uh, how you know, just kind of like uplifted were you about how you handled the second and third miles? Um, I think definitely after like the first mile going up that hill, I really like attacked the hill trying to throw in like a surge and then coming off like the tight turns, throwing in like quick surges to get my speed going back up and just like really focusing on like the hard like hills and like the second third mile. Back. Most definitely. When I had the blessing uh, earlier today in the, in the actual sophomore race of talking with Riley Biddle from Rancho Bernardo and I said like, bo like both of you uh, just have uh, such uh, you know, a, a powerful stride, right? Uh, yeah. like just you, you being, you know, but so many times, you know, uh, uh, women of, uh, of, of your height, you know, don't always use it to their advantage, you know? Uh, how, how much are, do you feel like you're kind of just, you know, finding your flow, finding your rhythm, and, uh, and, and, and kind of finding, you know, what works best for you, not only on the uphills, but the downhills as well? Um, I think definitely, like, downhills have been hard for me because my stride's so big, it's hard to get going. Um, but like attacking the hills, I feel like I've had like been able to adapt really fast and get like my feet going and then like with like my big stride, like being able just to just like let myself go. So to go 17.54, you know, largely untested, you know, up, uh, up front and the fact that it's only September 21st, like just how, I mean, is, is this kind of right in line where you feel like uh, the, the fitness has been and now, you know, you know hoping that there's, you know, some more competition and, uh, you know, and, and some more company uh, yeah. around you to really, you know, help you kind of take the, uh, that next step by the time we get yeah, to finals I'm in November? Really hoping to get some, like, good more races with a lot of competition in there. I know, uh, like, two weeks ago I had CCA where I ran really good and I had good talk competition up there. So just I hope, like, more of those races to help me, like, achieve what I really can. Fantastic. Well, uh, absolutely brilliant effort. Some people go, uh, four years, even some of the best of the best in the section's history, uh, and, uh, and, and never win a great race, let alone Invitational. Harper Diaz uh, already has the Invitational victory here as a sophomore at the 44th A6 Mount Carmel Invitational, 17.54.3 at Balboa Park. Harper, fantastic job. Stay Thank healthy. You. Congratulations. Thank you.